what's going on youtube welcome to the channel thanks for checking out the channel and if you're new to the channel make sure you hit that like button and hit that subscribe button where we're always dropping new toyota tacoma content so we are out here at wilsonville toyota in wilsonville oregon you guys and they got a ton of tacomas on the lot i think i've counted about 20 so let's just kind of see which ones they got on the lot so this is a fully loaded sport that they have here going for around forty nine thousand dollars now um, this dealership does not do any markups, you guys. So if you guys are in the market for um, a vehicle um, and you're in the Oregon area or maybe you're out of state, maybe reach out to these guys if you see something that you like in the video. I do not work for this dealership. So I don't work for Toyota at all. I just love doing this. I love to see what they got on the lot. So this is a limited right here, you guys. And let's see how much they want for this one. This is a six foot bed. This is nice and it looks like they got the chrome package on this one. So let's just look. So they're doing discounts is what I was trying to say. So they're offering a dealer discount of uh, $2,600 on this one. So this is $44,600. So um, that's the one price here. So their slogan's uh, one price, one salesperson, something along those lines. But uh, a lot of vehicles on the lot, definitely. There's a lot of uh, forerunners as well. So let's just get back into it over here. So here's an SR5. So a lot of these Tacomas are white. So um, you know, that might be one of those things far as if you're looking for a third gen, it's going to be colors. I think, I think we're going to see a lot of colors that might not be that desirable um, at these dealerships going forward um, until all the third gens are gone. But this is a good looking SR5 and I'm really curious to see what the price is on these. I like these SR5s, but I do like them um, when they do have the black fender flares, but this one doesn't, but it still looks good and they do have a lot of options. So on these SR5s, I've never seen one with the LED headlights. So you're going to get the halogen lights with the LED daytime running lights. And then you're just going to get your fogs down there. And you're going to get that SR5 grill, which I think actually looks pretty decent. All right. And this is going to be an ice cap. Let's get a price on this bad boy. Jesus. Am I missing something here? $40,000, you guys. $40,000 for a SR5. Man, this is a 4x4, you guys. And you're going to get the tonneau cover on there for $650, okay? And then you're going to get the blackout package, which runs you $430. But that gets you the Tacoma, the SR5. And they even got the, uh, so you get the, you get the tip, I guess. So you get the exhaust tip that comes with that. And then you get the blacked out Tacoma back there. And then the 4x4 and the V6. And this is the OEM, um, tunnel cover here and i like these ones because they say tacoma so that's really really cool so that's oem so that came from the port but yeah forty thousand dollars you guys so that's the going price for these so definitely in a case like this you know um you definitely want to do some negotiating and hopefully you can get a really really good price on this truck maybe they can come down a few thousand dollars wouldn't that be nice so um so yeah so that's what they got on an sr5 that's a good looking truck but see, look, so here's the SR5, and then you got it next to the uh, the TRD Off-Road, all right? So these are two really good-looking trucks here, um, both in ice cap, like I said, formerly known as uh, Super White. Now, you see the Off-Road here, so this is why I like the Off-Road, because of all the black accents. And you're going to notice here um, the LED headlights, okay? And then you're going to also get a factory skid plate right there it's going to be really really thin so if you if you're into skid plates and all that stuff and you do want to protect underneath your vehicle i recommend that you get the aftermarket you know or oem aftermarket trd skid plate the trd pro skid plate looks really really nice but uh man this ice i mean yeah this ice cap off-road looks really really nice here now this is a nice package it's a five foot bed so you guys know this is this is me i really like this now this is forty four thousand. so let's just kind of compare the two so this is about five thousand so it's forty four thousand nine so let's just say forty five thousand so it's a difference of uh five thousand dollars so you're gonna get so with this truck you're gonna get the rear locker you're gonna get crawl control and uh you're gonna get the led lights and you're gonna get all the toyota safety sense so you're gonna get uh premium navigation yeah so you get the premium um eight inch touchscreen navigation led headlights fog lights technology package and you're going to get the parking sonar and blind spot monitor with rear cross traffic alert okay and that comes with the color key bumper 
So this is gonna have all that Toyota safety sense stuff for you in the back where you got these right here, these little black things. You get all that and this uh, looks, see the blacked out Tacoma looks really, really good in the V6. It looks really good on a, on a white truck. So with this guy, this is actually $41,000, you guys. So I said 40s, this is $41,000. So it's a difference of about $4,000. Uh, these trucks are all closed or locked. But uh, yeah, so see how you got that chrome bumper back there. And then you get the different size tires on these SR5s. So the SR5s come with 245, 75, 16 okay so kind of comparing it to so what do you guys prefer the sr5 or are you going to go with the off-road you know, with the off-road you get that rear locker you get your crawl control you get you get everything you get the uh the bill the bilstein uh, suspension which i really really like a lot and you get the 265 um 70 r16 on the goodyear wrangler with kevlar at so you get a better tire and a more aggressive looking tire and a little bit bigger tire so yeah and let's just look at these prices one more time and you get those leds and you get the screen too so that's one thing i this one doesn't have any bed lights i want to just see how big their screen is in here if it just looks the same Yeah, the, the infotainment center looks the same. That looks the same. Make it a little bit smaller here so we can get them both, both in that picture for you. But yeah, the SR5, it looks good. Like I said, this front, little valance down there has got to go. You know, that front um, air dam, the air dam's got to go. I'm definitely not a fan of that air dam. But yeah, I'm definitely a fan of the off-road right here. This looks good. So, oh yeah, here's another thing. So that off-road, see that that stock off-road looks, it looks good. It even looks good with the mud flaps. Let's 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 make it bigger and just kind of just really look at it. It's a good looking truck right here. It just looks, it looks, it looks beefy. It just looks beefy from the factory, you know? It just looks like it's ready to go. Like it's a good looking, well-built truck. Like the tires and stuff, the wheels and tires, the stock wheels and tires look good until you want to upgrade and you start looking at other wheels but they look good just coming off the you know just as it is if you had to roll them but uh yeah that's just the kind of you know so let's look at it one more time because i keep on forgetting the prices and you can kind of see their options on this technology package this is actually a pretty good package the only thing it doesn't have is the leather and the sunroof and they want like i said so 45 and then this one's 41 right yeah 41 so this is a four thousand dollar difference a four thousand dollar difference and like i said see a four thousand dollar difference you might be able to get them to come down four thousand dollars on this on this off-road and then you got the off-road for the sr5 price you know or you want to get them to go down lower on that sr5 price so the sr5 versus the trd off-road so there's probably a lot more options that i didn't miss with the two but you can kind of just look and tell you know um i definitely like the mud guards and stuff you get a you get a whole different grill you know you're getting a whole different front grill it just looks completely different but you can switch all these parts so you can make this thing look like a trd pro if you wanted to but uh have to do a lot but you can do it Thanks for checking out the channel, you guys. Have a good day and God bless. Peace.